ऑनरेबल चीफ गेस्ट मिस्टर जस्टिस इरफान सादात खान साहब मिस्टर जस्टिस हसन फिरोज साहब ऑनरेबल वाइस चांसलर जस्टिस रिटायर्ड प्रोफेसर काजी खालिद अली साहब मिस्टर यासीन आज़ाद साहब मिस्टर मोहम्मद आकिल साहब मिस्टर जस्टिस अली असलम जाफरी साहब रजिस्ट्रार सिंध हाई कोर्ट मिस्टर फहीम सिद्दीकी साहब प्रोफेसर खुर्शीद हाशमी साहब माय डियर कुलीग्स स्टाफ स्टूडेंट्स अस्सलाम वालेकुम टुडे शहीद जुल्फ़ार अली भुट्टो यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ लॉ इज सेलिब्रेटिंग द इंडिपेंडेंस डे आई वांट टू थ्रो लाइट ऑन थ्योरी ऑफ सेपरेशन ऑफ पाकिस्तान फ्रॉम इंडिया पाकिस्तान केम इन टू बींग ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ टू नेशन थ्योरी द टू नेशन थ्योरी इज अबाउट टू डिफरेंट नेशन लिविंग इन सब कॉन्टिनेंट दैट इज हिंदूज एंड मुस्लिम्स हु हैव अ डिफरेंट रिलीजन कल्चर सोशल वैल्यूज एंड बैकग्राउंड एंड दे कुड नेवर मर्ज विद ईच अदर इन स्पाइट ऑफ लिविंग टूगेदर फॉर सेंचुरीज द मुस्लिम्स एंड हिंदूज वर अनेबल टू कॉपरेट एंड को एग्जिस्ट विद ईच अदर The major religious difference between Hindus and Muslims was the belief in oneness that is tawhid. The Muslim believed in the equality of human being whereas the Hindus were divided into different castes. There was no place for women in the Hinduism whereas they were greatly respected by Islam. Muslim and Hindu spoke and wrote different languages the language of muslim was urdu written in persian script and the hindu spoke hindi written in devanagari script in 1867 some hindu leaders demanded that the use of urdu language should be discontinued in the government offices and replaced by hindi language it was in 1867 when urdu hindi dispute started in banaras in that connection sir sayed ahmed khan wrote a letter to the divisional commissioner of banaras in that letter sir sayed used word nation for muslim and he wrote now i am convinced that these two nation hindus and muslim will never reach on any agreement upon any matter in the future that is why sir sayed ahmed khan is also known as the father of the two nation theory allama iqbal gave clear concept of two nation theory in his presentation address at allahabad in 1930 he gave the idea of separate muslim state in south asia by joining the northwestern muslim majority areas allama iqbal said I would like to see the province of Sindh Punjab and WF and WFP and Balochistan together as a state for the Muslim of South Asia as their final destiny. The Qaid Azam in a number of his speeches made it clear that Muslim are not a majority uh, not a minority but they are a great nation of 100 million people. He quoted that Hindustan is neither one country nor its inhabitant or one nation this is a subcontinent consist of two major nations hindus and muslims these two nations differ in religion in culture in civilization in language and literature in art and craft in short we differ in every aspect of life so it was clear that hindus and muslims were two separate nations therefore muslim leaders demanded a separate homeland for them after years of hard struggle muslim succeeded in